Well, hey guys, have you ever had old pieces of steel laying around your house or an old farm implement or just anything like that in that world that's just old, rusted, it's not fixable because you just can't get parts for it anymore uh, or whatever the case may be. Uh, you can't sell it and you don't want to just give it away. Well, I've got an option for you and I'll tell you right up front, this is something I have never done in my life, but it's called You Can Go Sell Scrap Steel. We have a recycle center here in Danville and I am going to go do this for the first time ever. So come on guys, let's go learn how this works together. Guys, one other note, please be sure to hang on to the end of this video. At the end of the video, I will go over with all of you guys the numbers of how exactly it works, uh, how much they pay per pound, uh, how much uh, the, my, how I made out. I'll even share with you exactly how much the weight is that I'm carrying in and how much they paid me for it. So be sure to hang around to the end of the video. All right, so when you come in, we're gonna run up on the scale and we get weighed in full. And then I think we have to do the same thing to get weighed out. Back around and pull up on the ramp one more time and then you weigh empty. And then they do the math and figure up the poundage that you brought on board and they pay you. So we'll go see how all this works. Just to recap the way that process works. So the first time I pulled up on the scales, it was to get a weight uh, of how much I am fully loaded. And then obviously I pulled off and I emptied out. Now, as you see in the video, the uh, gentleman running the, uh, the big machine with the magnet on it, if I wanted to had, I could have waited and he would have actually came over with the tractor and lifted the bush hog out of the back. But they were obviously very busy. I had the capability of doing my own dump bed. And so it was just easy and fast for me to get that done that way. But they will obviously unload for you if you need them to. So anyway, we offloaded, then I came back around, uh, went and weighed and got my empty weight. And I don't know if you noticed, uh, I think I had the video going, but you hear a beep tone. Uh, and what that is, is the lady that's inside, she's beeping to tell you she's got your weight and she needs you to pull off the scales and move on. And so I went back the second time, got an empty weight, then pulled out of the way. I went in, she gave me my, calibrate, or my calculations and, and paid me. And so uh, I'll tell you all of the what I did just in to lead up to the very end. Um, the way that works is around here, they do $7.50 per 100 pounds of steel. And for me, I was just over 600 pounds. So it was a, it was a cash, they pay cash, and it was just a little under $50. So from my situation, it was actually a great experience. I had an old implement that was so old, I could not uh, do any repairs, cannot get the parts for it. Uh, it was just sitting in the way, rusting away. I could not sell it. Uh, I didn't want to just give it away for junk. And so for me, that was an, about an hour and it was an, a viable option and I made almost 50 bucks. So I'm, I'm glad I did it and I've never done that before. Uh, one other note worth mentioning, as you saw when I was pulling in, it's Don's Recycle Center. Don is an old, old friend. I had no idea that he would be there today. He was actually the guy that was up on the tractor that had the big magnet on it. And so I was able there for a minute. I didn't get that on camera, but I was able to get his attention. He stopped and we visited for just a couple of minutes to catch up. I hadn't seen him in years. Uh, but anyway, it was great to see Don as well. So anyway, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed that. Again, this is something totally different, uh, something out of my norm. But uh, again, I love doing these type things. And again, here at Project Next, we learn stuff as we go, and I always like to share that information with you. So guys, I hope y'all enjoyed that. Thanks for riding along for the trip out that way, and I uh, uh, hope, hope again you'll continue watching on the channel. Guys, remember here at Project Next, there's always one more, so uh, definitely keep tuning in. Hit that uh, notifier so you'll see, because I always try to do about two videos a week. So for now, guys, you guys take care, stay safe, and we'll catch you soon. Thanks for watching.